Texas school district had to temporarily shut their doors after a COVID-19 outbreak, but now they're doing what they can to make sure every child has access to Internet. K2K Sarah Legray joins us live from Big Sandy this morning to share how parents can make sure their kids have all the resources they need. Good morning, Sarah. Good morning, Cynthia. Big Sandy ISD shut their doors last week due to a surge of COVID-19 cases in the area, and they're going to be closed until October 5th. That is next Monday, but for now, they're providing accommodations for students who don't have internet access at home, making sure no student gets left behind. Now, some accommodations made during the remainder of the in-person learning hiatus. The district's parking lots offer Wi-Fi access that is accessible 24-7. Students and parents can sit in their cars any time of the day to complete schoolwork. Now the district has also opened the elementary school gym and junior high gym for students to use from 8 a.m. to noon. Officials say all students must remain around 15 feet apart. They are currently being supervised by school employees. Students who have tested positive for COVID-19 are not able to use the gym facilities until they have been officially cleared by the school. We can to offer uh, some options for kids that don't have internet at their houses. We've also ordered a bunch of hotspots through a, a program through with TEA, but those hotspots have been delayed and we haven't gotten those yet. So we hope if we have to do this again, that we would have hotspots that we could pass out as well. The district asked for those that do have internet access where they live to just stay at home so students without Wi-Fi have the first opportunity to access learning from campus. Now, Superintendent Mike Burns says right now, while the school is closed, they're currently working on thoroughly disinfecting and sanitizing the area so that when the students and faculty return next Monday, they have a very safe return. Back to you, Cynthia.